Hi guys, welcome back to Pregnant Some Simple Life, where every video I make is super simple. Today we are going to be making some goodie bags um, for my son. This time, it's not for his birthday, it's for Valentine's Day. So I showed these in a previous video, but these are little goodie bags that I purchased at Dollar Tree. Um, they have a little panda bear, not polar bear, I'm saying it right this time. And inside I already put um, the Valentine's cards that he signed his name on. And then we folded them, we put like a little heart sticker on them right here. And then inside is a little like tattoo that's scented for some reason, I'm not really sure. But today we need to finish putting stuff inside of them. So I thought that since my son already did his part, you guys can um, follow me along while I finish. So I have 24 bags like this. We're not going to do all 24 because um, I'll probably be here a while. Plus it gets kind of redundant. But what I first wanted to do is take this um, box here. This is the Lifesavers um, Lollipops Fruit Variety. I also showed these in a previous video, but you take this uh, sticker here and you attach it to um, the lollipop and it has a to and a from little thing down here, little box. I'm not going to make my son fill it out again, but I am going to go ahead and try and apply the sticker to the lollipop. I haven't even opened it, as you can see. So I don't know um, what to expect inside. Hopefully none of them are broken or anything. And on the back, it does come with a teacher Valentine's Day card. If we flip it over, you can see right there. So I just want to make sure that I don't throw the box away. And I cut this out and for the teacher. But for now, I'm going to pause real quick because it's going to be loud. I'm going to dump out the lollipops and we'll get started putting stickers on them. Okay, I'm back and you can see all of the lollipops in front of me. Lifesaver lollipops. We have yellow, which I'm guessing is like lemon. We have this very dark color. I think it's supposed to be like grape. We have green. My assumption is that it's apple. Um or maybe watermelon or something like that. And then red is probably cherry, or this one might be watermelon. I'm not really sure. This is going to be crinkly. And then you can see over here, we have the stickers, which I thought were going to be bigger than this. Um, they're pretty small, but you can see the to and from little thing. I'm not going to do that part. I'm just going to Take a sucker and uh, apply some stickers. We won't do all of them on the video, but we'll do some so that we can um, do the goodie bags. And then you just kind of stick it on there. I don't know what my daughter's uh, class is going to do for a Valentine's Day. Um, her teacher said they are going to do something though. And I got my daughter the same box, so she might write from, and then her name or whatever. But there's one. It says, um, have an epic Valentine's Day. <laughs> That's cute. Let's do a red one. And I'm just going to grab the next sticker. It says, you're too cool. And kind of just stick it on. It kind of seems like these are not um, going to stay for very long, but they are going to go in a little um, goodie bag, so it's fine. We have a green one, and then we have a sticker that says, Be Mine, Valentine. I wish they were different colors. Instead of pink and purple, I wish there was some like reds and blues and stuff, you know. Okay, be mine, Valentine. Cute. Um, what color do we not do? Yellow. 
and I think it's yellow. This one says BFF. I bet you could probably turn this way too, huh? Like that. They just don't look the same as the picture. The picture made it seem on the box like it says BFF really big. And then the to and from part is really small, but it's not. And let's do a couple more. Another purple one. There's little pieces of candy everywhere. It says, have a sweet day. Maybe I'll do it this way. This seems to stick better this way. Okay. I gotta make sure I say this when it's critical time. And which one have we not used yet? Well, I guess it's like in a pattern now. So we haven't used any of these from this row. It's like a whole new row and they're all different. Um, put it this way. Turn it up. Okay, cute. Let's do one more, maybe like... Red. Like this one's broken, see? That might be where it's coming from. We'll see. I might not give that one to a kid. But I feel like kids don't care, right? They just throw the little crumb parts in their mouth and then eat the sucker. You rock. Thank you. I appreciate that. Okay. So I'm going to push the suckers and the stickers aside. We're obviously not done. I just wanted to get a couple done um, for the purposes of this video and for the purposes of the bags. Okay, so let me pause because I'm going to push these out of the way. Okay, I'm back and I brought a friend with me. The next thing I'm going to do is open up the bouncy balls. Um... Because those are going to go in the bags. Each kid is going to get one Valentine's Day bouncy ball. I'm going to throw my trash on the ground, actually. And then if you look inside, this is going to be hard to see. Let's see if I can get my camera to focus. Do you see that? It's a heart. Isn't that cute? Inside every bouncy ball is heart glitter. And they come in red, green, blue, and pink something for everyone. Be prepared for some crinkles. Here's some candy. Each kid is going to get one piece of this chocolate. There's 25 pieces. So we have Reese's Peanut Butter Cups, Kit Kat, and Hershey's. Kind of similar to the last one we did. But I think not exactly the same. Okay, we're gonna throw away this. And I'm gonna slide this in front of me. Kind of out of my way. And then I have more candy. <laughs> surprise, surprise, but it's kind of out of my reach. It's, I have to stand up, so you're probably hearing sound. We have Skittles and Starburst. Then we have the Hershey Hearts from the previous video. So each kid is also going to get one of these candies. Um, and also one of these. Not a Skittle and a Starburst, a Skittle or a Starburst because I'm going to save some for my daughter's classmates, too. So, let's cut this one open as well. Okay. Well, as soon as you smell it, you can... Uh, 
open it, you can totally smell just the overwhelming aroma of candy. So strong. And then the last thing to open is this. I didn't want to cut any of the hearts open. I can like, I can kind of feel inside. I don't want to. Oh, they're beautiful. Look how cute. They're so cute. Look, there's like a pink color too. Just like the front packaging. They're so cute. Okay. Let's fill out some of these bags. Okay, so we have the cute bag and we have the um, little Mario Luigi Valentine that my son already signed. We're going to take one of the bouncy balls. I chose red. And you have to be careful because the bouncy balls are kind of sticky on the outside. See how they're like already sticking to the bag? I'm going to have to like push them down like that. Kind of like that. Okay, and then we'll take um, a green sucker. And put it behind the bouncy ball. Oh, the bouncy balls are going to give me a hard time. This was unexpected. Okay. So the bouncy ball is on one side of the valentine. And then the lollipop got put to the other side. Maybe I should turn the lollipop so you can um, see the cute sucker. Like that. That's good. Okay. Then we're going to take one of the Hershey hearts. This is the pink one. And we'll put that in there. Cute. Okay. Then we're going to take a Skittle. And put that in there. That's a pretty good bag already. I would be happy to get that for Valentine's Day. And then we'll do... Um, oh, look at this Kit Kat. It's so cute. I'll put a Kit Kat in there. Kit Kat will open it up like that. And then all you do is... You uh, seal it up like a a ziploc bag and then you can see that it doesn't open and that's it every single kid will get one of these so it has the mario valentine's day card the bouncy ball the the little candy heart the bag of um skittles the kit kat and the lollipop i'm sorry but this is like the best thing i've ever done i think even better than the birthday goodie bags. Okay, so that's one. Let's do a couple more, shall we? Okay, what do we have next? We have another bag where the Valentine's Day card is already in there. I think I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna take the Valentine's Day card out, you guys. And put the sticky bouncy ball in first. I'll do a green one. They look pretty. I'm gonna like hold it open like that. <laughs> and try to like shake it down. I'm sorry that's not relaxing. Look it like sticks. There we go. Gotcha. Then put this back. Like that. And then we'll do a silver Hershey heart. I'll push it down there because it's little. Like that. We'll do a U Rock sucker. Like so. We'll do a um, should we do a Starburst this time instead of Skittles? Like that. And then we'll do 
a Reese's peanut butter cup in purple. Isn't that cute? Okay, so we have Reese's Starburst, Red Sucker, Green Ball, Silver Heart, and then of course the Valentine. So this one's ready to be sealed. Okay, my son's teacher said there's 24 kids in the class, but to make several extra, I only have enough of the Mario um, Valentine's Day cards for 24 kids. So the extra ones that I'm making will have um, no actual Valentine's Day card in them, which stinks, but what are we gonna do, right? Okay, so we have a pink ball, empty ball. Is like the worst part. Oh my gosh, seriously. Oh wait, am I getting even better at this? Gather the bag and then throw the ball down there. That worked pretty good. Okay, put the perfect card back. These balls were a mistake, you guys. Don't tell my kids they're excited about the bouncy balls. I don't know why, but they were. This one says, Be My Valentine, and it's green. So stick that in there. We'll do Skittles again. I'm gonna try to like squish it. And then I think I didn't do Hershey's yet, so let's find the Hershey's. It's gonna be very crinkly, so I guess. I had to go digging. Oh, look at the front! That is so adorable, the pink and the chocolate brown color. Okay, Skittles and Hershey's chocolate. And another Hershey chocolate, sucker, pink ball, that's still sticking to the bag. It's like trying to, the ball sticks to the plastic the way that, like, plastic saran wrap sticks to each other and you can't get it apart. Look how the ball's, like, stuck right there. Like, wherever you put it, it's stuck. What are going to do? Okay, let's see here. That was three, right? We're on our way. So we have the bag. Looks like it's another Mario and Luigi together inside. Power up Valentine. That's cute. We haven't done a blue ball yet. No jokes, please. We haven't done a blue ball yet. We're going to gather up the bag almost to the point of it being inside out and dropping the ball on the bottom. I'm sorry, pain the bear. It's close to the bottom. There it goes. Okay, then we're gonna grab one of the pink Hershey's and put that in first. Okay. Then put the Valentine's card back. See, there's always like a rhyme and reason to everything. You just gotta get the hang of it. We'll take a BFF lollipop. Best friends forever. We'll take a Starburst. Stick that in there. And how about a Kit Kat? I don't think we've done that combination yet. And the panda bear is full. These are really cute. I'm not trying to toot my own horn, but I'd be happy to get this from somebody. It would make me feel like so loved on Valentine's Day, and I'm a grown up. <laughs> They're really adorable. Okay, we have three more suckers, so let's try to do three more bags together. I have to keep doing bags after you, but you know what I mean. 
have a great Valentine's Day. Look who it is. Oh, little princess. Okay, so that goes there. I'm going to practically turn the bag inside out. I'm going to grab a red bouncy ball. Stick it in there. And then put the bag back to be right. I feel like we did a lot of silver in a row, like several silver ones, so let's do a couple of pink hearts in a row. Okay, and then we're going to put the Valentine's Day card back, now that the smaller stuff is in. We'll do a purple, have a sweet day sucker. And then we'll do a Skittle. Yeah, we'll do a Skittle. It's good. And then we'll do another Hershey bar. And then we will seal it. Ta-da! Okay, super good. I hope I get to do this with my daughter too because they're so good. She has bags just like this, but they have hearts all over the front. Like, I think it's like pink and red hearts in like uh, horizontal and vertical rows, like covering the whole front. And they're so cute, and I want to be able to do this. I got bouncy balls for her, and I got suckers for her, and I have more candy for her. So I hope that she gets to do something like this. Hopefully today she'll get um, news from her teacher. But it's like I told my daughter, I was like, what if your teacher finally says what your class is doing for Valentine's Day and it's it's like a donation situ like situation for like a for a class party. Oops, forgot to put that back in. If it's like a donation um, situation for a class party, I don't want to open up all the bags of candy. Because then what would I donate, you know? Okay, we have Skittles. We have Reese's Peanut Butter Cup. We have Sucker, Green Bounce Ball, Silver Chocolate Heart, and then I, I remembered to put the actual Valentine's Day card back in. Okay, let's go ahead and do one more together, shall we? Looks like this one is just Mr. Luigi all by himself. It says, you are a super friend, and yeah, it's just Luigi by himself. Super cute. How about we do a green ball to go with Luigi? What am I going to do with two more packages of bouncy balls if my daughter doesn't do bags like this? <laughs> I'm going to have to return them. Some Skittles, Hershey's, a Luigi bag because I forgot. We got another purple, probably grape sucker that says have an epic Valentine's Day. So I stick that inside. And then a Kit Kat bar. And then we can seal this little fella. And that's it because that's all the suckers that we added stickers to together. I'm not done, obviously. I have to make at least 24, probably more like 26 or 27. Um, but like I said, the couple extra ones I do, the like just in case ones, they're not going to have the Valentine's Day cards because I literally... Those came in a box of 24, and I only bought one box. 
Because if you buy two boxes of 24, but you make like, you know, 27 or so, then what am I supposed to do with all the rest of those Mario um, Valentine's Day cards? It's like a waste of money. So, if they get a new kid in class all of a sudden, the new kid's just going to get candy and a bouncy ball, and I think that's perfectly fine. Anyways, you guys, um, that is it for me. I'm going to finish making these and try uh, not to eat these delicious little hearts that are definitely calling my name. I have to make sure I hold on to all extra candy until both kids have goodie bags, which is torture. But if you want to see more videos from me, please like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to go finish up these bags and go get my kids at school. Have a good one. Bye.